Hello and welcome everyone. Today I will be reviewing this mouse. I, you can see it from the box. It is called S Mouse RGB Backlit Wired Gaming Mouse with nine programmable buttons and an optical sensor. This is for computer, PC, any kind of computers, PC, laptops, desktops, whatever. First, it comes in this uh, regular box. It's just a box with no any marks, no any writings on it. So you don't know what this box has until you open it up. Okay, first I'm gonna open it up. Um, you can see that the mouse is covered uh, in this just normal nylon. Inside it, there's the mouse. You can see this is the mouse. Okay, um, let's just uh, discover what else in the box, and then you continue. There's the user manual. Yes, this is a user manual. Um, Chinese and it's all in Chinese. This is actually not very good, but I guess that only describes the software, the software, the software. So nothing else but the software, and it's I think just easy, just like any other regular software. There are some specifications, the voltage, the this is the the mouse is how it looks. Okay. Uh, there is something else also here. It's also written in Chinese. No need to read it. Okay, let's put all of this stuff aside. And let's see at this. Look at this mouse. The mouse is... I think the build-up quality is good. It, it doesn't make any sound when you move it or anything like cheap mouses. Um, the bottom seems to be good. Also, these uh, plastic uh, bands on the bottom. This is the optical sensor. The click sounds good. It sounds good. These clicks also. Okay. The scroll is smooth. Uh, they're not like some of the mice where the scroll is like you feel like you're going each step like it is a click. Like that, that, that. No, that's not like that. It's very smooth. Um, the cord, the cord is not rubber, not nylon, it's cloth, uh, you can see, I, I like it, I actually like it, it's not uh, that breakable, it can be easily break. The, the, the place where the cord is connected to the port is well done, nice, it's not gold plating, but no one would uh, get a gold plating for a 20 box, okay. Okay, now let's plug this in and see how it does look. The cord is, uh, before I go on, the cord is like, I guess, 2 meters. 2 meters, nice. That's good. It can be connected to any PC or any setup without any problem. Okay, now it's plugged in. Okay. Um, the RGB lightning is on. You can see it's... Uh, Pulse or something like this, color changing and pulsing. This changes. Um, it's like color flow. Uh, yeah, this one is color flow. That the other one is color cycling. This the color flows from, I guess, bottom to up. And it's off. It's off. Okay. Um, let's look over here at the screen. the Amazon page of the of the product. It's smooth in the surface of the in my surface, I mean the my mouse pad. It's smooth. Let's move on to the software now. Okay. Um, where's the software? Okay, this is the software. So now okay. Okay. Um you see here is the first page which is the bottom settings. Here you can Assign the macros. You assign the buttons. Uh, actually, sorry. Uh, this is number one. Is the left click. Number two is the right click. Eight and nine are the scrolls. Three is the scroll click. Six is the DPI changing. Um, seven is the lightning, and four or five is the side button. Okay. Now you can assign any any one of these buttons. You can see like now four. I'll make it um, fire button. And 
click apply loading okay let's try to put score in any mission anything okay when i put score here let's double click actually and double click so it's on it twice or maybe triple click let's keep on pushing four yes it keeps on clicking it that's nice in first person or any shooter games that will be very helpful in case you're playing with a pistol and he's go like uh, take nine or anything that will be very helpful okay now mo uh, you have also i forgot you have uh, five profiles you can change any of them okay um in case each game you, you can make a profile for each game that you play now moving to the lead settings there are four kinds of leads as we shown the standard mode you can make it only one color let's see over here let's make it green the pulsation is like middle intensity middle fine so you can adjust the camera so you can see the pulse um okay this is green and it's pulse mode okay now let's go on standard mode sorry then uh, go into the new mode new mode this is the new mode it keeps cycling through the colors I'm making it fast so let's try to make it slow apply and I guess it's used slower yes it is slower okay I can also make the lids off so that, that, not, that doesn't matter ripple mode from bottom to top and from top to bottom um, the speed is fast and apply here and from bottom to top okay now from top to bottom and apply going like this okay that's nice uh, color cycling you can change each color which cycles these are the standard you can only change the pulsation rate maybe making it like this try slow or changing now green red green coming back to green the same color even though that's stupid yellow purple maybe it's just a bug blue and let's try to make it making it fast why green uh yeah come on stop yellow purple blue white red red it's coming red twice green okay i guess that's it for the lead settings the macro man managing macro you can just record any macro i just found out a new thing in that doesn't have that you can't find in other uh, mice that I, at least that i've tried is there's inserting a mouse event like you can see here left click right click wheel up and down forward and backward that's really nice that's really nice for some games you need to make a macro using the mouse too but some mouses that only gives you a macro using the keyboard okay now going to the dpi setting this is the best thing i have liked about the the mouse is that i can change the dpi going in a margin of 20 uh, 250 dpi in each step see like 250 500 750 1000 and going up to 4000 in five profiles that's that's really nice that's really nice i've been looking all over for um cheap mice that has this and i've finally found it the margin is like very small it's just 250 you can play csgo with it any other shooter games and you can change the profile um uh, okay th here you have restore settings load files save files. the last thing is the advanced settings is the double click speed the wing point windows pointer speed is like this the pointer speed enhanced pointer precision no one recommends this the usb pulling rate it's better to make it 1000 and the scroll wheel speed this is one page if you want to scroll to go one page you click apply and okay um one last thing even when you close the the software from you from the background the the macro will still work look now I'll press like here. See it opened the fire button that I told you about first. See? Um that's it. Now let's go to the overall what I think overall of this um, mouse first.
The mouse is cheap, it's only 20 bucks. That's really good. The weight is, yeah, there, there's some weight in it, but it's not heavy. The colors are amazing. The feel is also great. The ergonomic, it's really good to the mouse. I have a medium size and it's filling my hand. And feeling it in my, uh, on my uh, mouse pad is, it's good. It's sliding, it's not lacking. And that's what actually matters about a mouse. Thank you. If you like this review, just press like and subscribe. Thank you all. And I'll be going on with another review for another product. Thank you. Everyone.